staying on the ice, it's not all rocket science, science for a group of jet propulsion laboratory men and women who play hockey for exercise and for a fun outlet. Their team name is Lagrange Points, which may be the only giveaway that they're scientists. Jill Painter Lopez caught up with the team on a recent Sunday fun day. Oh, it gets you so excited every Sunday. You know, it's a lazy Sunday. You're kind of just hanging out, maybe vegging out on the couch, and then you're like, oh, it's time to go play hockey. Let me go. And you get yourself worked up, and you get excited. You get here in the locker room, you get all your gear on, you throw on that jersey, and you're ready to go. Welcome to what can be best described as smart hockey. These rocket scientists at Jet Propulsion Laboratory lace them up almost every Sunday night to have some fun and release some work stress. It's a great workout, it's a lot of fun, it's great hanging out with the buddies. When you're on the ice, you can't think about other things. So even if you're stressed and you just, you know, you're, that's all gone when you're on the ice. Uh, if you lose focus, you're gonna get hit or something. So you're the, the GM and, and the coach. Uh, what are people who work at JPL like on the ice? Well, they're all, we're all fun. I guess some of the more fun things you more see on the, um, in the locker room about, we'll have conversations about, about, you know, various science topics. But, you know, I, I'll say some of the other teams will say that we're a really smart team. Or we play really um, smart out on the ice. Uh, you know, I, I don't see it. I just know we go out and play and look for each other and try to be in the right position. Now, that's what some of the other people play, say when they play us which is sometimes frustrating when they know they can outskate us, but we're in the right position. But you outsmart them. Yeah, or just, you know, we watch a lot of hockey. So, you know, you watch a lot of hockey and you see where you're supposed to be. And, and if you play that way, you know, you can, you can often be competitive with people who are more skilled than you. So it's brains over skill. And appropriately, these space experts didn't choose a mundane name for their team. No, they're not the Kings, Ducks, Bruins, or Flyers, but rather something that most of you are not very familiar with. So Lagrange points are special places in space where the gravity is balanced. So in this case, it's where the, where the gravity from the Earth and the sun are balanced. So you can kind of cruise around the sun following with Earth, but some ways away, about three times the distance uh, of the moon. So for example, we have them on our jerseys here where this is the, the sun and the earth and this is the first Lagrange point, the second Lagrange point. These are like the cell phone waiting lots of space, right? If you're in earth orbit, you're circling like LAX, very, very tiring, very frustrating. Um, but if you can go and hang out at one of these Lagrange points, you can follow along and it's a quieter part of space. You have a huge view. Um, so it's great for astronomy. It's great for finding asteroids, um, Lagrange points.